Michael McLear with the Michigan State Firemen's Association here with Chief Tanya Hoover, Superintendent of the National Fire Academy. Chief, thanks for having me in today. Thank you. Thank you for joining me. Absolutely. We wanted to talk about some of the training opportunities that are available to all members of the fire service and especially beyond the state weekend opportunities. Can you speak to that? Oh, absolutely. I love talking about training professional development here at the National Fire Academy. One of the pillars of the National Fire Academy is our command and control curriculum based area. So when we talk about command and control, we're talking about uh, preparing for man-made disasters. We're talking about strategy and tactics of company operations. We're talking about safety officer, um, initial decision making for company officers. So really, uh, if, if someone is interested in taking operations to a, a higher level in that decision making space here at the National Fire Academy, we can prepare them for that and we can help develop them into stellar and a lot of our courses now, we have pre-course assignments because students in the past have said, these are great activities, these are great concepts, but we really wish we had our local data so that the instructors and the classmates can work together and really better isolate their local problem, identify that problem, prioritize that problem, whether they're a training officer, whether they're a risk reduction practitioner, a company officer, even a chief officer, there's something for everybody here at the National Fire Academy. Absolutely, it doesn't matter where you sit in your fire service or in your emergency operations or within emergency management here at the National Fire Academy. I believe that we, uh, we've got the, uh, the ability to accommodate your data needs and your professional development needs. Absolutely. So again, the National Fire Academy, great opportunities for professional development. Ongoing professional development is so essential for today's fire service leaders. And thank you for the fabulous work that the team here at the National Fire Academy does to continue to meet our local community's needs. Thank you very much. And it doesn't matter what space you're working on in, in, in the fire and emergency services, you're going to want to join us here at the National Fire Academy. We look forward to seeing you.